Around 10 in the morning, we received a call from the coordination center in Rome reporting a, a boat uh, with problems, mechanical problems, and around 700 people on board. Yeah, we are seeing three boats in the, in the water, some people swimming in the water. Our first boat has just gone into the water and is on the way to reach the people. So when we arrived, we couldn't see the boat uh, that was already capsized. We only just see the, the people that are gone. There were several people in the water, uh, some of them with life jackets, other ones without. Uh, rescue boats all around, and the Irish and Italian vessels were taking care already of the operation. This guy here, spear life wound in two places. We started recovering some of the people who were requiring medical assistance. Two of the injured, one pregnant woman and another woman uh, requiring immediate medical assistance. Absolutely all the people were under shock uh, because of the circumstances. This tragedy is a clear indication that the resources to rescue people in the Mediterranean Sea are not enough. And this will continue to happen unless the resources are increased and reoriented towards a humanitarian intervention rather than a military one.